SEC Western Division showdown between two old-fashioned rivals dating back to 1928. Ole Miss ranked 25th in the latest BCS standing. 30 yards per return. He's been the main man back on the kickoff return the last three games. Morgan Hull will kick it off for the Auburn Tigers. A junior out of Decatur, Alabama. Take it four yards deep and bring it out. And he is right. Loose football. Jason King with a big hit. Loose tail back of the eye formation. Snead gets it to Bolton. Bolton has plenty of running room. To the 40. To midfield. Knocked out of bounds at the Auburn 43-yard line by Darren Big. Gerald Harris, the tight end in motion. Little delay handoff to McCluster. He's got some room. McCluster inside the 20. And Ole Miss. Well, coaches will get just play for points. High pass to McCluster. He's trying to get the corner. He's got the first down. It'll be first and goal Ole Miss. They'll mark it at the seven-yard line. Lionel Bro with a big selfish football. Quick hit to the fullback, Andy Hartman, touchdown, Ole Miss. What a drive. Ten plays, backed up. The end zone. Justin Sparks will hold for Joshua Sheen. Point after is up and good for Andy Hartman, his fourth. Mario Fannin in motion. Will swing it to Mario, right out of the gate. Mario, he's an electrifying playmaker. Mario lost the football at the Ole Miss 40. It trickles out of bounds at the 30. And running the football in open space. Here's Todd. He will dump it off near side. Eric Smith, he's to the 25 and knocked out of bounds there. Factor of when a quarterback's going on a little bad spell. Here's Todd using his feet. Gets it inside the 20 for about the 18. On each side of Chris Todd on a third down. Let's call it. Four. Tough pass to catch for Eric Smith off his left hand. 36-yard field goal attempt, West Byram. 12 out of 13 this year. Sneaks it in the upright. Auburn on the board. They were moving. To the outside, and Shea Hodge, she gets close to the 45-yard line, and with that, gives us a chance to bring in the down and eight. Over the middle. That pass should have been intercepted. Josh Bonds let it slip right through his hand. On the edge for Ole Miss. Quick hit on the outside. Darvin Adams with the catch, and Coach Chizik along with Gus Melvin. to the top of your screen. He comes in motion now. Here comes some heat. Auburn picks it up. They'll swing it out to Burns. He makes the catch and slips down at midfield. First down, Auburn. Four-man front on second down. Look at Ben Tate, the big fellow. The nice move gets it to the 41. Excellent tackle by Kendrick Lewis in the open field. Smith in motion. It's Tate working the right side. Jonathan Cornell, the first man on the spot. Back into this football game. It's tough. McCluster trying to get that first down. He'll do so, run out of bounds. Let's see where they spotted at the 42-yard. Summers out of the I formation. Will delay handoff to Dexter. He's got a huge hole off the right side. Down to the 30-yard line. Give him a gain of 12. Andy Hartman, the fullback, with an excellent block. Third down and six. Need in the pocket. Off the fingertips of Shea Hodge, and that'll bring up fourth down. Nico Thorpe on the coverage. Joshua Sheen, who was perfect on the year, his long this season is 42. This may not get there. Well, he seemed a little rushed. I think he got the message. Sneed under pressure again. McCluster rocked at the 45. Oh. 
Here's Grandy coming around on the toss. He makes a man miss, has the first down inside the 40. Auburn might have had him for a loss, but the six coming up. Sneed all day to throw. Hit Grandy right in the hands and he dropped it. Season and converting on third downs. Todd going up top. Has a man. Zachary with the catch at the 40 yard line. Cassius Ball. Brady goes right back to work. Todd has a man wide open. Donovan Adams, touchdown over. 28 yards. We'll step on the field. He drills it through the uprights. Later, third down and 17 for the Rams. Long way to run for Snead, and he's going to get it. Are you kidding me? A 20 yard pickup there, but didn't make a play on the diminutive McCluster. Here's Dexter now. He makes a guy miss. He's trying to get a block. Dives down at the 42-yard line. Sneed. Boy, he had some time. Throwing. Wide open. Hodge. Great catch. Lost the football. They'll say incomplete. Incomplete pass. Even to the end zone. Perhaps. Trying to get that first down the far side to Shea Hodge with three seconds on the clock. It's been fantastic running the ball physically. Nice, nice game. Going up top, looking for Zachary. He made the catch at the 20-yard line. Another exceptional grab from... He burns it at quarterback. He'll take the direct snap and will loft it up in the end zone. Looking for Tommy Trump. Touchdown, Auburn. Crowfoot will hold for West Byram. Short throw looking for Marquise Summers. They'll say it was picked, batted in the air, and picked off. Warren McFadden. Touchdown, Auburn. You gotta really see how he's gonna handle it. Point after up and good. Third down. Pressure coming. Snead drop back at the 17. He'll get it out to the 20. And who else but Antonio Coleman? Like that. And they've responded well in his first year. Durante Stallworth. Out at the for Gus Malzahn. 268 yards of offense to this point. Here's some more. Ben Tent. Tent turns the corner. Tent down the sidelines. He will score. Auburn points. Andy Dunn. Guess what, ladies and gentlemen, they're at 31 right now. By the way, Ben Tate has hit 3,000 yards in his career after that touchdown run. Here's Grandy. He's got room. Jesse Grandy being chased by Nico Thorpe, and he won't be caught. Touchdown Ole Miss. Welcome back, Rebels. <laughs> Kick is up, and it's good. Jesse. Todd just throws it out of bounds, looking for Zachary. Here's McCluster. He's got all day to run. Nobody 
will catch the speedy McCluster touchdown Ole Miss. There are no flags. 79 yards. <laughs> this is absolutely bizarre, and it gets even more bizarre. Could this be returned for two points? Auburn looking at third down and eight. Top drop back at the 23 yard line. Greg Hardy. Guess who? With the. <laughs> the cluster. That tailback, but Sneed will throw. Quick hitter to the outside. Pass caught. Shea Hodge lays down at the 35. <laughs> Out of the eye. Brandon Bolden. Loose football. Two twelve. Fan, the playmaker with a stiff arm to the forty. Out over the forty-five to the forty-seven yard line. Let's go down and a dozen. Lewis, I believe, was the man who knocked. Sneed, he lost the football. He got it back at the 45, but another five-yard loss. And Tom. Little handoff to Tate. That was read well by Lamarck Armour, the senior out of Nashville, Tennessee. I think, I think Tim can play a little bit, right? There's Sneed has all day to throw. Fires a bullet back over the middle. Incomplete. Looking for Lionel Bro. Oh, you're down. 13. Far side. Shea Hodge. First down at the 31 yard line. Walt McFadden on the coverage. And Shea Hodge. Smart play. Smart play to just go down. You don't want anything bad to happen. His second interception of the afternoon. Ted Roof's defense really put the clamps on Ole Miss offensively. Here goes Starworth. That'll be a first down, and that will do it. What an afternoon. What a third quarter. Auburn led 10 7 at halftime. And Started opening up with some big plays like that for Ben Tate. Used to nut. And how quickly you think you have it, just as quickly you, you can lose it in this league. But a great win for Auburn. They become bowl eligible under Gene Chizik in his first season with a 33 to 20 win. We will come back to Auburn and put a wrap on it. Stay with us on the SEC Network.